I want to talk about this. This is what I want to talk about today. And I feel like you guys know where I'm going to go with this. You know where I'm going to go with this. Let's talk. Let's talk about the Persona community, right? Let me let me let me start off by saying <clears throat> Let me start off by saying that I've played only Man, I'm burping a lot. Maybe I should wait. <clears throat> I've only been playing Persona since 2009, I think. Uh, when I started playing Persona 4, <clears throat> I rented it on PlayStation. And uh, I played Persona 4. I've played Persona 4 Golden. I've played Persona 5. I've played Persona 5 Royal. And then I went and played Persona 2. Um... Innocent Sin, I believe, and then I played Persona Three. Those are those are the that's the extent of my knowledge with Persona, right? That's the first thing I want to say. So, I'm a fan of Persona, really just Persona Four and Five. I don't know what it is. About persona fans but they get I'll, I'll say it like this the common conception around persona fans especially on twitter is that they get a pretty um they have a pretty bad reputation <clears throat> right they only talk about persona some of them have not even played the game it's mainly about the art and the music or the anime or whatever they are very waifu hungry the entire discussion is based around waifus and shit like this like this right here like this being fetish and I mean some of it are jokes but like this is not a joke the community that this community here, the one that does this, the one that focuses on fucking, on waifus and shit, and, and, and does all this, these people are in my DMs, they are in my YouTube comments, they are in almost everything that I've made since I've started making Persona. And I'm not gonna lie to you, it, it's, it, I don't appreciate it, right? I think it's it's completely fine to have a waifu and to appreciate characters and music and, and art styles and everything, right? It's completely fine. But when you create an entire, and this is ironic, persona on Twitter or on social media based completely around that thing, it puts a bad light on, on the community as a whole, right? The greatest thing I can, the greatest um, comparison I can give it is like K-pop stands, right? K-pop stands traditionally get a bad rap because they will, uh, as soon as they hear anything bad about their community, they'll they'll tend to attack it, right? They'll just get rid of everything from it. It's frustrating to people that are in the community that that just want to enjoy the things that they enjoy, right? I love, I love Persona. It's so, it's fun to make these videos. It's fun to hang out and, and talk about like the cool shit in it. It's fun to make fun of it. It's fun to do everything in it. But when I can't, when I can't do anything, because every time I mention Persona, 39 fucking Futaba on Makoto Kawakami fans come up to me and they say the same shit every time kawakami um that's what makes it fun teacher joke makoto beat boop futaba fucking l anything literally anything she's ever said or if they're talking about or i'll talk about like how i appreciate music like i'll talk about like literal music like actual like i'll be like oh i like this kind of rap artist or this kind of whatever and every time i mention rap it's someone's like baby 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 and i'm like i don't fucking understand 
and I think it's I think it's at its worst with Persona Five and Three. Persona Five and Three are the two the two that I get the most angry about <clears throat> because it's like it's almost an obsession. Like it's it, you can just see it. All these, all of these. What is this? It's fine. It's fine to, it's fine to pretend or role play. It's completely fine. But when you have a large community that fosters behavior that's when it can't accept other opinions and it takes it over the top people will not come to your fan base people won't try your games because they're getting gate kept i was talking uh i was talking with a friend and i said persona is so good it should be as it should be as marketable as kingdom hearts 2 think about it or Kingdom Hearts in general. Think about it. Kingdom Hearts, it, it's just Disney plus like a standard JRPG. It's literally just a, it's just a JRPG. And for the most part, Kingdom Hearts fans, they, they only just appreciate their game. There's like some weird shit in it, of course. There's weird shit in every community. But Persona should be on, Persona should be on that level. And when I talk about the Kingdom Hearts community, it's bigger. The Kingdom Hearts community is bigger than Personas. And and you're right. You don't see anywhere near this level of, of, of weird, of like people making fun of it and always seeing like very odd things happening all the time. And I don't want to, I don't want to make fun of anybody or, or do anything, but there has to come a point where you just have to appreciate the game as the game. It, because when you start taking it out of context and, and only focusing on the waifus and only focusing on this and that, it's it's gross. And and it it creates a culture that a lot of people don't want to get into. Myself included. I don't want to. I I didn't want to make persona videos because I just. People didn't let me make Persona videos the way that I wanted. The first day that I dropped Persona with no Persona, do you know how many angry comments that I got for not playing the, the, the game the way it's intended? Or because I didn't romance Haru? Or that I didn't show who I, who I, who I went on the Valentine's Day date with? I got like hundreds. But yeah, people people just kept showing up. And obviously the positives outweigh the negatives. I love the content. A lot of people got some good laughs out of it, um, which I was super thankful for. That was the whole thing. I just wanted to make something entertaining and different. I wanted to make something funny so we could all have a laugh. I wanted to create new memes. I wanted new persona memes so we could all laugh and have fun. But instead, all I got was, where's Yusuke is Gary European? Where's Beat Boot? Fucking, I, even I messed up because I put cat simping on a girl out there. And now cat simping on a girl is fucking everywhere. Well, not everywhere. I'm not going to say it's like this thing that I started, but it ended up being a part of that culture that I don't appreciate because they took it too far. And that's kind of just all what it is. Everything that they enjoy, everything in this part of the community that they enjoy, they take it too far to the point that people like me who just enjoy the game in my own way, I can't enjoy anymore. And it's frustrating. And when the majority of your community is like that, it not only impacts one person like me who makes content on it or whoever, it impacts several people. And it, and it, and it, it impacts an entire gaming community. And it stops people from buying these games. You know how many... There's a lot of people on Twitter that, that game, that like JRPGs, who have never heard of Persona. And they go, they're, they're going to find this shit. And they're going to go, you know what? I'm not, I'm not playing it. <laughs> and that's unfortunate. 
Because the game is one of the best I've ever played. It's an incredible story. Um, any person who would ever like JRPGs or just anime in general or, 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 or anybody who appreciates art or good storyline development would appreciate this game. It's, it's one of the best. I didn't, I didn't come here to just rip on the Persona fandom, but it says something, right? It says something when you, when you have shit like this, it says something to you. When 19,000 people follow this, just to see, just to laugh at people in the Persona community, just to laugh at them. 19,000 people follow this account just to laugh at how cringe the community is. I think we need to change the culture, right? I think we have to change the culture. That's what I want to do. And this is what I think we need to do. We need new memes. We need more inclusion. We need to do more. I want to see more persona content. I want to see more people love the game as is. I want to see less of this scramble to the West bullshit. I want to see less of this persona five to switch shit. More appreciation. I need more appreciation of what we have and how good everything is. And I want everybody pushing it. Persona's good. Persona's great. It's one of the best out there. It's, it's one of the most, it's one of the most beautiful experiences that you can get in terms of gaming. And I want to, and I want to be the one to spearhead this change. I want to see people enjoy good things. And even if more people don't play persona, we can definitely add new things to the community to make it more inclusive and, 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 and stop this kind of shit. Where, where we get laughed at as a community for being so cringe. They don't have to change, right? The people that are cringe don't have to change. They like what they like, and that's fine. And that's fine. But we need more positive things. More cultural important things, right? More culturally important things. Like better memes, better representation of, of, of leaders in Persona communities as figureheads in the, in the call of duty on the call of duty community, they have like scump and nade shot and all these people, right. Who make the game look cool to other people because they're good people. They, they don't post cringe shit. They're not arguing all the time. They post their memes. They have their fun and they go, I want to be that to persona, right? I want to be the one that's like persona's the shit. I'm also the shit. Let me show you why this game's the shit. Let's all play it. Have fun. Make memes do like do all this kind of cool shit. I'm tired of seeing this. I don't want to see this Twitter account anymore. Well, maybe sometimes for a good laugh, but I don't want to see it as like the, the, the main point of, of persona. Here's a good example. The smash community is probably the best example I can, I can give you, right? People love smash, right? People love smash. But there's like weirdos in the Smash community. We've learned that this year. But why did we view it so favorably? Why did we like the game so much? Mango, Void, other leaders in the community that, that had fun at these tournaments. Zane, Ludwig, Slime, Scar and Toph, Big Lev. All these people that made the game so fun that got other people that weren't current that, that weren't completely cringe towards the game into the game they got people into smash because they were having fun and they weren't being weird about it they just enjoyed the game their way they didn't force anybody out as a matter of fact they brought more people in so it's something i'm super passionate about i just love the game i i and i do love the people in it and i want more people to get interested in persona that that I've never heard of it before. So that's what I'm going to do. That's what I want to do. I don't want to I don't want to be burnt out from Persona because I feel cringe all the time. And I don't want to get burnt out knowing that someone's going to DM me 30 seconds later talking about how I fucked up this or I should have known that or I should have wifed this person or that person. I want to play the game my way 
and I want to get more people involved. And I want to have a better, and I, this time next year, not even next year, by the time SMT5 comes out, I want, I want this shit to stop. Because these games deserve love out, outside of everything. That's just what I wanted to talk about. I know, I know, I've, I know I've talked about it before, and a lot of times I've sounded so upset. I've sounded upset like a lot, and it sounded it sounded like I was burnt out or depressed or stuff like that. But it was really because of this, man. No, we want to see. That's the thing. I want it to be inclusive. I don't want to. I don't want to shame people away from it. You know what I mean? I don't want to shame people away. I don't want to shame people for, for, for feeling how they feel about Persona. If they do, if they like that cringe shit, fine, fine. But I want to have, I want to just have more. But I just, I hope that when I'm, I'm going to put this on YouTube and I hope that, I hope that when I, I hope that when I put myself out there like that and I'm, and I'm honest with you guys and I'm raw and I'm, you know, I hope the community doesn't turn me away.